book we're going to read in this video is called Future Flowers. So I see a boy and a grown up, maybe his mom or grandma, auntie, neighbor, cousin, older sister. What does it look like she's doing? Holding the bag of leaves and what is he doing? He has a rake and it seems like, seems like the leaves are falling. They've changed color from green to yellow and orange. Please forgive Athena. Shh. Future flowers. Oh, and I see a kitty cat. Let's see. Oh, and it's written by Karen Mathlear and illustrated by Sandra Satsbury. Illustrated means she drew and colored the pictures. Written means Karen wrote the words. Sandra illustrated or drew the pictures. Read the title again with me. Future flowers. What does the grown-up look to be doing in this picture? Digging a hole. And here he has a big shovel. And there's the cat looking in the bag. Here's our focus question. How can you prepare for spring flowers in the fall? So it's fall right now. The leaves are falling, but they're getting ready for spring flowers. So there'll be winter and then spring then summer, then fall again, right? Try to read with me in your own book or point to the words on the screen as I read them. Try to read with me out loud wherever you are, practicing your words. Words to know in this book are bulbs, fall, plan, plant. Those words are really close, except plan does not have a T on the end. Spring, winter. Fall is the time to plan for flowers. Huh, I didn't know that. So the calendar says September. Here's pictures of beautiful flowers. Kind of match the ones on the table. What kind of magazines do you think the grown-up is looking at? Probably flower magazines, right? We call those catalogs. But winter is coming, Rex said. So Rex is thinking about it being fall, and this looks like snowy icicles that'll come after the fall and winter. is the time to get busy outside. But winter is coming, Rex said. What is Rex imagining? Fall is the time to dig in the dirt. I wonder why you dig even though it's going to get cold before you can grow your flowers. But Winter is coming, Rex said. How does Rex feel? Look at his eyeballs. He's like, so confusing. Fall is the time to plant some bulbs. So look closely. It looks like he's holding a leaf, but this is called a bowl. It's actually kind of thick like an onion or a potato. And that's what they're planting. But winter is coming, Rex said. What's he imagining here? That they planted all these flowers and they all die because it's going to get cold. Winter will come with snow and cold. Then comes spring. <gasps> What's going to grow from the ground in spring? The flowers. So writing and art. What do flowers need to grow? Use the book and what you already know to draw a picture and label what flowers need to grow. 
I know it started with a bulb. I know I've seen seeds. We put them in the ground outside where there's sunshine. What else? Water. Mm. And time. They need time to grow. In math, you can create a graph showing the favorite types of flowers of your classmates or your family. Maybe you can look it up on the internet with your family and see which ones you guys like the best. Or maybe take a walk outside. Thank you and sorry again about Athena. I hope you enjoyed Future Flowers and we'll read it again on your own.